So in today's video, I will be showing y'all how you can get the trash vest onto any outfit in GTA 5 Online after the new Los Santos Drug War DLC and a patch of 1.65 and yes, this method does still work and yes, pretty cool glitch on how you can get the trash vest on any of your outfits and yes, it is the orange trash vest, the one you see on my character right now uh, but quick shout out to my top 3 most recent subscribers so before I get into the video, shout out to these people on the screen right here for being subscribed to the channel if you do want to get a shout out in any of my future videos, all you have to do is click that red subscribe button. So literally all you gotta do is go like below, you'll see you subscribe and click that red subscribe button, like this video, and you can possibly get a shout out in my future video. Basically what I do is I just pick three random people that I've recently subscribed to my channel, and I just give them a shout out in my next video. So if you subscribe right now, you might get a shout out in my next video. Also this glitch did work, make sure you comment down below so other people trying this out also do know that it works. Um, but yeah, I said we could get straight into it and we are gonna start exactly from the apartment So no cuts literally Right away from the intro. We're gonna make our way So basically the first thing what we're gonna have to do is make your way to any clothing store So wherever you spawn at this point inside my apartment, but wherever you just spawn, just find the closest clothing store to you and Basically now all you're gonna have to do is make your way over there and by the way you can equip any outfit um, for this glitch right here, so you can put the trash vest on to any outfit, so it doesn't matter. Just equip the outfit that you want to have the trash vest on. So I made my way over there, so as you can see. Um, so yeah, this part right here, I did cut out, but this is before I had it. So as you can see, I did equip these pants right here. Now what you're going to have to do, after you equip the outfit that you want to have the trash vest on, you're going to have to equip utility vest number 43. After you've done so, you're going to have to save this outfit in any empty slot. Now after you save the outfit in any empty slot, what you're going to have to do is make your way to a Heist Coveralls. So you will need to spend a little bit of money on Heist Coveralls, but trust me, it is worth it since most glitches are actually done with the Heist Coveralls. So just make your way right here to Outfits, Clothing, until so start scrolling until you find Heist Coveralls right here, number 12. And equip any of these with the gas mask on. After you equip the Heist Coverall out with the gas mask, you're gonna have to make your way to any telescope, so either inside your apartment and the, or the one at the pier, that I, that's the one I went to. So as you can see, we're gonna do a telescope glitch. This is what happens when you don't do the glitch right. Basically, we, what we want to do is we want to walk by the telescope, spam right on the D-pad, and if our character does not look into the telescope, that means the glitch worked. So you just keep doing that until, so as you can see, boom, there I got it, and after I did get it, so my character did not look in, I'll open my interaction menu, go to styles, and equip the outfit that we just saved. Now after I did equip the outfit we just saved, all you're gonna have to do is just make your way to a mask store to actually save it. Or if you did it inside your apartment, you could just save it over there. So you save this in any slot, so I recommend you do save it in the same slot that you saved it previously. Now after you did save it, all you're gonna have to do is open your interaction menu, go to online, jobs, play jobs, rocks are created. You're gonna have to start this mission called a titan of a job. Okay, so now you just start it up, and by the way, you will not need anybody for this glitch right here, so this part right here is going to be completely solo. Uh, we will need uh, someone later on, but right now, you just start it up on your own. And just like that, we'll say launching session. Now, once you did load into the mission, um, basically, you might not have, so if you did use like an oppressor, you might not have like a weaponized vehicle inside the mission, but that's okay, just get like any street car you can find, and you're going to have to make your way to ammunition. So this one right here, it doesn't matter which one, you'll see it on the map. Now we just save this outfit in the same slot as before. And you'll know that the glitch worked if the Peach Plate Carrier, so utility vest number 43, disappeared from your outfit. Now you're going to have to leave the mission. After you did leave the mission, you're going to load back into online. Uh, basically just like this, so you load back into online. And once you did load back into online, you're going to have to go back inside ammunition or any clothing store. And uh, for this part here, you will need to bookmark a job named It's a G Thing, but I'll tell y'all more about it later on, so just keep watching. There's a few more things that you need to do, so uh, you don't really have to worry about that right now. Basically, you're going to have to equip an outfit with the trash vest to actually transfer the trash vest onto this outfit right here. And if you do not have a trash vest, I have a video, I already made a video about a week ago on how to get it. So you saved this in the slot previously from the slot, we saved the other one. Now you're gonna have to start up it's a G thing and put the cl the player clothing on player saved. So clothing on player saved. Now what you're gonna have to do is go um, twice to the right or once to the right until you are on this outfit right here. 
that we had previously saved. So as you can see, I'll go twice to the right. There we go. So like I said, if you do not have a trash vest, I will leave a link uh, in the pinned comment or in the description how you can actually get the trash vest. Because I know a lot of people were confused on how to actually get it. I did make a video on that. This is like kind of a part two to that video on how to actually put it onto any outfits. So if you haven't seen that video already, make sure to go check it out. And basically, all you're gonna have to do is just back out of the mission and go back into online. Keep watching because there's one more thing that we need to do to actually um, save it. So basically, now you will spawn with whatever outfit you had the trash vest on previously. Now you're gonna have to make your way to any um, pedestrian car or it could be yours, like your car. So now you just make your way over there, you're gonna have to like shoot the window or something like just like that. And then you have to register as a CEO and you're yeah, trying to not get run over like I did. So you register as a CEO, go to management, go to style. Now you're gonna have to go inside the vehicle and go once to the right and then once to the left multiple times. So right, left, right, left, and then get out of the car and boom, as you can see, now you have the trash vest on your outfit. Now all you gotta do is save it. He's making your way to a clothing store and yes, this will be a transfer glitch, so you will be losing all of your outfits. And basically, so might as well just delete them in the beginning. And now you just keep the outfit that you do want to keep. <clears throat> so you will be keeping one outfit. So I recommend you do this on a brand new account. So do not do this on like your main. Go to swap characters, by the way, after you respawn. Now what you're going to have to do, you need to make a second female character. So make a second female character just like this. So you, for this glitch right here, you need to have your male character on the left. And your female character on the right now once you made your way to a clothing store with your female character we're going to be making the component outfits so basically what you're going to do you need to make your way to pants and equip the muscle pants after you've done that you're going to make your way to tops you're going to have to go to leather jackets and equip this jacket right here um which is going to be this one so i'll show you in one second this one right here so number 52. now after you've done that what you're going to have to do is basically stay at tops and then make your way right here to tank tops and equip number 94 after you've done that what you're gonna have to do make your way to shoes go to boots and you're gonna have to equip any cowboy boots so it really doesn't matter what cowboy boots you do equip just equip any cowboy boots that you can find um, in the boots they there usually was like a different type of boots but they did end up getting removed but for this glitch right here, you can use any cowboy boots and it's still gonna work. So I'll just do that. Now once you equip the boots, what you're gonna have to do, make your way to accessories and make sure you do not have any accessories. After you make sure you don't have any accessories, you're gonna have to make your way to gloves. You're gonna have to equip these gloves right here. Which is gonna be number 58, the black wooden gloves. After you've done that, you're gonna have to save this outfit in slot number 2 and call it Trash Race. After you've done that, we're gonna go on to the second outfit and for this we're only gonna have to change the tops and the armor. I mean not the armor, the gloves. Now you go to gloves, make your way to gloves and equip like woodland armor number 32. Now make your way to tops. You're gonna have to make your way right here to um duck t-shirts. So duck t-shirts. And basically all you're gonna have to do is equip the black classic. After you've done that, you're gonna have to make your way to I believe to to uh, denim jackets and equip number six. After you've done that, save this outfit in slot number three and call it trash one. After you've done that, we're gonna make the last outfit. So all we need to do is change the tops. So make your way right here to tops. You're gonna have to go to um so party tank tops and equip number one. Now after you equip number one, what you're gonna have to do is make your way right here to I believe leather jackets or tactical jackets equip number 79. Once you've done that, you're gonna have to save it in slot number four and call it trash two. Now you're just gonna have to take the easy way out to force the game to save. <clears throat> if you enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like on it and subscribe to the channel. And yeah, like I was saying earlier, it is better to do this on a new account um, if you don't really want to lose your outfits. Because like, if you do have really good outfits on your character, then you really won't really want 
to lose them but if you do have like a new account that you just got and don't have any modded outfits on it you can do that now you're gonna have to start up creator now create click on create a race you're gonna have to click on tutorial and just accept the alert Now once you accepted this alert, you're gonna have to go to online, you're gonna have to choose character, so click on choose character. Now basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna delete our female character on the right. So delete the character we just made. So go to the character, click on delete, you're gonna have to spell out delete. After you've done that, you're gonna have to back out into story mode or back out into the main menu if you are on next gen. Now you just back out into story mode like I did. Now once you back that into story mode, you're gonna have to start up an online session. Now we do have a few more things that we need to do to actually complete the outfit. So it's pretty simple to actually do. And yeah, I do think it's a pretty cool outfit. There's currently no other way to get the trash vest but the transfer glitch. And like I said in my next video, I will show you how you can put it on any of your outfits. So yeah, it'll be pretty cool, you know, once you get more outfits, I guess, after this glitch right here. Um, you will be able to put it on any of your outfit. Now you save the outfit that we previously had. This is the one that you're gonna have to keep. Do not save it in slot number one. Save it in any slot but slot number one. So here we go, just save it like that. Now after you've done that, what you're gonna have to do <clears throat> is basically you're gonna have to go right here, go to outfits, clothing, you're gonna have to make your way right here um to suits basically Gorka suits. Once you made your way to Gorka suits, you're gonna have to equip this suit right here, which is the orange Gorka suit. Now, after you equip the orange Gorka suit, you're gonna have to go to jobs, play jobs, bookmarked, and you're gonna have to bookmark this job called It's a G Thing. I will leave a link in the description and the pinned comment so you can bookmark it. And at this time, you couldn't restart your application, so it doesn't really matter. If you don't have a bookmark, you bookmark and it restarts your application. Once you bookmark the job, just start it up and you have to have somebody to join so you need a friend or a random to join you so just invite someone to the job and make sure you put the clothing to player saved outfits so i'm gonna wait for someone to join and then basically all you're gonna have to do is start it up and this part right here is a bit tricky because there is a, basically on this outfit there is a blacklisted component if you do not know the checkerboard is blacklisted um and the checkerboard will be a bit on this outfit but i will show you there's actually a workaround I could like keep doing the glitch even though you know you do have a blacklist item on it and don't worry at the end of the outfit your outfit will stay on nothing will be blacklisted on it it's just like the beginning part right here that we're doing right now but I'll show you how to bypass it now you go once to the right and boom now you ready up now you will see you have this checkerboard so this is what I was talking about that is blacklisted but don't worry like I said I do have a workaround how you can like bypass this now make your way to your apartment it's not gonna be on the map but you should know where it's at so just go over there and basically all you're gonna have to do is just save this outfit um in any of your slots i suggest slot number one and now you're gonna have to delete the outfit called trash race so slot number one and delete tra trash race and back out of the mission now as you can see it does go away after a few seconds but i still found a way how you can actually do this make your way to a clothing store and basically when you have like this little default outfit you're gonna have to make your way to accessories once you're accessories, you're gonna have to equip the outfit we just made and then go straight to accessories. So equip it and go straight to accessories. So as you can see it doesn't disappear. Go to gloves and equip these gloves right here. You're gonna have to equip these ones right here. So it's gonna be number 50. So as you can see, you do have invisible arms now, which looks pretty cool. Now what you're gonna have to do is start up it's a G thing once again, and you're gonna have to invite someone to the mission. And now this is the last time that we're starting up it's a g thing and then the, the outfit will be complete there we go now you just start it up and put the clothing on player save the outfits and just invite someone to the mission and there we go once that person joined you're gonna have to start up the mission and now basically all you're gonna have to do is go twice to the right so one, two, and then once back, or basically no, just twice to the right, you go to trash two, and you will see you have the trash vest on. Now basically all you have to do is make your way to apartment, uh, wherever your apartment is, but like I said, you should know where it's at, 
and you just save this outfit in any of your slots and now you can delete the outfits that we used to make this outfit right here and now you have this really cool trash vest outfit and yeah it looks really nice and you know if you did just do this glitch and lost most of your outfits um i do have multiple clothing glitch videos so you know you can get back really fast and actually get even better outfits which you had before and yeah in my next video like i said i will show you how you can put the trash vest onto any outfit so make sure i click that subscribe button that way you don't miss it because i haven't really seen that many people make videos on how you can actually get the trash vest most videos are on how to put it on any outfit and i've seen a lot of confusion so i decided to make a video on it but yeah i'm gonna catch on my next video peace